So some of the concepts that I've been getting a ton of feedback on include how to host and the components of hosting. To recap the idea that our goal is to try to get an internship. Our goal is to try to get hosted, but sometimes to prime the pump of the general population just expects you submit an application, some company reviews it, finds that you're the perfect person that they've been searching for, and then you get housing, you get a cubicle, you get a bunch of things that just magically open for you. That's just not how uh, it happens because there's kind of a lot of people that want to work, uh, that want to get a base amount of pay plus bonuses, base plus commission, base plus stock, base plus stock options. I mean, that's the... That's the goal, is you have that safety net and the massive upside. How do you get to that massive upside is by hosting a, a event and being a self-starter. Being, uh, not necessarily doing what's called uh, don't ask for permission, ask for forgiveness. There's actually a methodology where you don't have to ask for permission and you also don't have to ask for forgiveness. It's incredibly street smart to host. These are some bullet point uh, concepts to execute in, in, in hosting. You wanna host where you're at, one, okay? Now, if, and I need to know, so I'm open to, to feedback. If you wanna email or tweet at me or text me, just text. Facebook will block because if we're not immediate friends, uh, you're not gonna be able to Facebook message me. It goes to my other inbox. 650, grab a pen, 650-283-8008. That was fast, grab a pen. Don't take out your phone and punch this in, okay? Grab a pen because you're gonna wanna put it on a, on a post-it note, which is a piece of paper that you use with a, one of these devices, it's a 650-283-8008. 650-283-8008, 8008. Hosting where you're at entails, uh, entails, uh, literally on the college campus that you're at, building an awareness for Silicon Valley, uh, hosting a speaker who used to go to, you know, University of Illinois, uh, now started Yelp, now started PayPal, now is a VC who started PayPal, um, now is an angel investor named Max Levchin who also started PayPal. Uh, now is Jeremy Stoppelman, who's currently still CEO. So, so hosting in that part might take uh, planning, but the concept of hosting where you're at to build an awareness for Silicon Valley, for uh, something that you can do right now is interns that are potential interns headed to Silicon Valley, doing a small group five, if three or more people are organized, that's a party. So you want to host it on Eventbrite because what is you don't know about but happens is that work has momentum. In the same way that food marinates, so does work. And doing work builds momentum. Analyzing and stockpiling knowledge does the opposite of momentum. It stagnates you. It paralyzes you. It analyzes you. I mean, anal retentive is in part... Analyzation, which is analyzation, analyze. So when you're doing, I know. So when you're doing this work, it's part of it's supposed to be funny because I say this stuff all the time. The work in and of itself has momentum. The the so let's say you're doing a small event and you load it up on Eventbrite, and what you're doing is you're engineering up a tidal wave of momentum and it becomes a perpetual promotion machine. That's what hosting does, E-U-T-W-M-P-P-M. It's not an acronym, it is a business subroutine. It is actually a signature business subroutine. I'll repeat that, E-U-T-W-M-P-P-M. Engineer up a tidal wave of momentum, perpetual promotion machine, E-U-T-W-M. 
ppm, EUTWM ppm. So that's one small event that you'll do. And then what EUTWM ppm is, it uses your Eventbrite, links to your PlanCast, links to your Facebook, your Twitter, and Twitter's just 15 tweets. Set those 15 tweets, follow two people. Um, you don't even need to follow me, tweet at me and I'll follow you back. I'll be your first follower, I don't care. Less than minimum viable Twitter account. Your Eventbrite, your Facebook, Twitter, WordPress, YouTube, not a seven minute YouTube, 30 second YouTube. Embed that into a WordPress and what you're doing is you're notifying, hey, I'm interested in coming to Silicon Valley, I'm interested in networking, I'm interested in meeting up with an alum of random university that you currently go to in the Ivy, okay? You're notifying that is a micro step towards you getting your first legendary internship after freshman year. Because you're sitting with a skill set that a lot of people, quite frankly, have as a freshman. Uh, but you are a, you're so close to becoming a competent 30-year-old or even surpassing a competent 30-year-old in CS. A sophomore in CS, there's never been a smaller difference between a sophomore in CS and a 30-year-old in computer science. What you're doing with these momentum pieces is that you're, you're networking in a way that old people, seasoned executives as a euphemism, are networked with. So, so you're, you're, you're hosting and you're sending a Gmail alert saying, hey, I read this thing, I saw this video, I'm taking action. And that, that you, you read a little, do a little, reread, do a little bit more, Tweet, reread, do some more. It it it's a pump of of execution. It's a it's a perpetual promotion machine. The last part of EUTWM PPM. The other component after you do a small first event, where almost no one comes, maybe you and two friends. If ten people come to your eleven minute party, which is a less than minimum viable party LTMVP, that's a success. The second thing you want to host, and these things take very little time if you just crank them out, which is you want to do an after party. If you're lucky enough to live in New York City or in the New York City metro area, there's a TechCrunch event that's May 4 to May 6, and you can do an after after party. Currently there is an after party on May 4th. Currently, there is an after party on May 5th. There's another after party on May 6th, but there's not an after after party that you can host in a hotel lobby. If you're under 21, that's fine. Don't supply alcohol, don't buy alcohol. You can do tap water and pizza, plus execs, old. We don't wanna drink, okay? We want a place to sit our butt down, to drink some tap water or bottled water, maybe pizza, okay, maybe a salad, I mean, Tap water and salad party. So the after party concept, what you're trying to do is you're trying to get a higher deal flow because the next thing you're gonna wonder about is where am I gonna get housing at? This is how to get housing. By you yourself solving the problem that VCs and angel investors and celebrity entrepreneurs face, which is we all need to know where the next crop of founders are coming from. And it's all from interns. Today's interns are tomorrow's uh, founders, tomorrow's unicorn founders. Uh, Diane Eisner of Waze, uh, Lisa Falzone of Revel, Travis Kalanick, uh, UCLA Computer Science, uh, Luke and Kenny, I mean, they're pulled from Max. Levchin and Max was Illinois and they're like he's like oh I'm gonna get uh, Luke to be my biz dev person I mean that's how that's how internship and that's why I came to Silicon Valley is to help out Luke so this internship thing even though you feel like you're underqualified doing early work will maximize serendipity of of fortuitous meetings 
So the after party concept, the 11 minute party concept, UTWM, PPM, those are all things to help you host because you wanna go from what the general population of, of Harvard and MIT kids are, come discover me, okay? Come find me in my awesome junior status in CS. I took CS183, I took CS183B, I took 106A, I was a TA for that. Being, those things are awesome, but you're also going to need to to self start, self do, and a little little bit of self promotion as well, to try to help you gain uh, additional deal flow uh, for internships. Opportunities are forms of deal flow, and by you executing and hosting and reading a set of books, which I've wrote about in the Boston area blog called Harvest Harvard Business School is The Fifth Epiphany. The Fifth Epiphany lies relies on five books. So before you come to Silicon Valley, uh, read those five books that are under The Fifth Epiphany. Four Steps to the Epiphany, Lean Startup, What They Don't Teach You at Harvard Business School, uh, Business Model Generation, Crossing the Chasm. God, those five books roll off the tongue. Crossing the Chasm, What They Don't Teach at Harvard Business School, Business Model Generation, Four Steps to the Epiphany, Lean Startup. The other bullet point with hosting is this. You as an undergrad, people will help you if you're a student. And that's what Intern Palooza was about. It was a high school kid from Texas who was able to host. And hosting takes you from being a guest where you're sitting and waiting for things to happen to a host where you're organizing and then having that, that, that fortitude to start. To for that 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 enthusiasm to execute. That's what people are looking for. Uh, it was great meeting.